did you guys want to borrow some of my balls? I think someone sharded, and it might be Mrs. Cole. Everyone check. Check. Shart check. You can look it up on Urban Dictionary. Fail. You couldn't find that stone if it was in your kidney. I can see your back acne through your blouse. Well, look at you, just drunkenly spewing out joy like a shit Santa. Yep. That's you now, yeah? Nicole's spending the night at Becky's. We had a fight. First fight is a married couple. Ta-da. You want a beer? Sure. So, um, I'm sorry, okay? I let Nicole talk me into it even though I knew it was a bad idea. I'm not like you, man. I can't just hook up with somebody if they're already with someone else. It's wrong. It was wrong when my parents did it to each other. It was wrong when Megan did it to me. It was wrong when you and Nicole did it to her ex. You don't think the fact that we got married kind of justifies it? No, I don't. Not unless you want to be married to someone who doesn't mind cheating. Hey, that's my wife, okay? Nicole talks a good game, but she's been hurt like everybody else. Her ex was a dick. Treated her real bad. It's complicated. All this love shit's complicated. And that's good. Because if it's too simple, you've got no reason to try. And if you've got no reason to try, you don't. Oh, oh. Wait, I just described you. you know, maybe you're right. But either way, you're an arsehole, Alan. Hit a three-pointer. I sent him my application today. Oh, so you just gave up? Oh. oh, I'm not giving up. I'm going, getting back to the life I was supposed to have by now. When you're old and wrinkled and your penis doesn't work anymore, not that it's in great shape now, but in that old, wrinkled, dickless future, will this seem like the right call? Yes. I'll think dropping out of med school because of a girl was stupid. Not chasing after a girl who doesn't want me was definitely smart. I'm a doctor now. I've saved probably millions of lives, because I'm brilliant. I cured the zombie epidemic, you remember that? I'm the one that found the cure, so you can just all be grateful, shut up, and stop questioning my decisions. <laughs> well, it was supposed to be a secret, but Loose Lips over here knocked me up. Oh, <laughs> shit! You got a baby in you! Yeah, I know! Congratulations! <laughs> oh, that means the apocalypse has really started. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> and you're the first person we told, so you can't be mad at us anymore. And you have to forgive pregnant people for anything they've ever done to you. It's like a federal law. Bill, wow. I can't wait to meet this kid. And <laughs> we're having a going away party for Chantry. And you should come to it to say goodbye. No. Oh, please, he's not even a real doctor. No, no. He's a real doctor. You finished his degree. Alan, in Asia. We're not Asian. It's legitimate medical training. Wine, please. Here, ask him. After you have a baby, if you eat the placenta, does it count as cannibalism? You know that's not really a medical question, right? If a baby's hand is bigger than its face, will it have cancer? No, it just means your baby has massive hands. Oh. What's going on here? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, it smells that. Wait, can you write us a prescription?